Okay guys, Steve here again from RC Tanks and Trucks 24-7. Check out the previous video if you want to see how I made this fifth wheel for the San F450, converted it to this four-stroke Toyan L200. Let's give it its first test. Start her up. Here we go there. This is a HD 10 kilo all metal trailer. So let's see how it goes. Hey, it's working. Not too sure about how this stock clutch will go. But let's have a look how it's turning up here. Ah, proof of concept, it does work. Yeah, definitely, I think that clutch needs a, needs a new clutch after this. Bear in mind, guys, that that is 10 kilos, a trailer alone. <laughs> yep, <laughs> it's slipping. Uh, under further inspection, I have two grub screws holding in this drive shaft, and one of the grub screws just came out. So, put a new one in there, and... Uh, Let's hook her back up again and see how she goes. And here's that uh, fifth wheel that I set up, painted it, it used to be just bare aluminium, painted it up black and it looks pretty good, but I'll show you after this run a little bit longer. There we go, started back up again. Back in action. Let's see how well it's turned out. But I think the clutch definitely needs a, uh, a bigger clutch, a stronger clutch. I've also got a reverse. myself. <laughs> Whoops. What happened here? Interesting. So, save himself. See if the clutch slips without the trailer. Really well. It's second gear, and I think it's running out of fuel soon. We're going out quicker. Yeah, kind of second gear. <laughs> but uh, definitely some more work to do. But I wanted to show you this quick bit. It's working. I think next time, um, next video, I'll try to get some weight on the back of that. See how that goes. Hmm. Interesting. Oh, and I couldn't end it there. I have to at least try get a crawl on the back and see how it performs. All right, let's sit it around about there, and uh, we'll try it. See how it performs now. Give it a go. So definitely the clutch needs uh, upgrading. But uh, let, let those tails come back up automatically. And uh, let's let's try it back up. Just put a little bit more fuel in there. So we can give it a test. Definitely a struggle for that little clutch. Right. 
it is working. I need to work on that little mechanism. Let me shut it off. Yeah, so I think I need to work on that mechanism or it's not hooking, hooking on, obviously enough, but uh, proof of concept, it is work. First uh, drive with it actually on, with the trailer and with the a nice heavy, that's quite heavy too, that RGT crusher. I'll leave a link if you want to check that out. But uh, definitely brushes, electric motors are perfect for this stuff. This isn't uh, really feasible, but it's a fun project and uh, I don't know, I want to give it a give it a go. It's all part of the hobby. Now if people want to know how I did this, like I said before, here is a little setup, really simple. It goes across the body post and all the weight goes right above the axles. That's all it is. Aluminium plate, two holes, one for each body post, and then two to attach the actual fifth wheel on. Super simple. But uh, I'll try work on this later on, and hopefully I can get it. Maybe, or I think it's got to be a better clutch as well. You can hear it slipping. Uh, I fixed the issue with the drive shaft spinning on the, you know, with the missing grub screw. So it's not that. There's two in there now. So it's something to do with the clutch. And uh, but other than that, it works. I'm happy with it. It's all part of the hobby. Let me know what you guys think in the uh, down below. If you like the video, give it a gold thumbs up. If you haven't, please subscribe and uh, see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.